EDIT format and it allows to plug in uh, several emitters. And this is one uh, example I'm working, I think find most useful uh, compiling to JavaScript. Uh, the way it works, uh, since the compiler is written in Pro 5 and it emits JavaScript, I uh, emitted the compiler to JavaScript and loaded the compiler in the browser. Um, <laughs> now uh, you have here, uh, this program is not really interesting, but it uh, shows uh, some of features that are uh, implemented, like uh, uh, here docs, um, uh, some well, quotes, uh, add underline, uh, uh, loops, uh, string interpolation, and uh, eval. Um, yeah, you can create classes, you have namespaces, uh, bless works. Uh, you can mix in, uh, this is, yeah, kind of hack, uh, you can inline JavaScript. Uh, yeah, um, so yeah, you can use this for output uh, because I, uh, made uh, this output to go to the uh, box below. Um, yeah, uh, string replace and uh, some cases of uh, reach access work, not everything, uh, statement modifies. So this is uh, executing uh, really in the browser, there's no server side uh, code. And it generates uh, JavaScript that is then uh, evolved by the JavaScript engine and uh, yeah, it just works most of the time. Um, it uh, passes, uh, it also uh, works uh, with the Node.js and it, um, let's see, yeah, uh, in this case I used a, a ahead of time compilation to convert a program from uh, uh, Perl 5 to JavaScript and execute directly in Node without any Perl involved but the, the source code is uh, Perl. Uh, this is about uh, nine times slower than Perl, uh, pure Perl. Um, uh, the reason it's slower because I, uh, I've implemented uh, some things that disable uh, V8 uh, optimizations. Uh, yeah, depending on the features you want to support, uh, it will be faster or slower. Uh, this is part of the source code. Uh, it's just plain Perl, and it needs to be because the compiler needs to understand it. Um, yeah, you see, I have uncommented. I've, I have commented Java because I'm not really working on it, but uh, have some ideas uh, compiling Perl five to Perl six. Uh, there is also a Perl five to Perl five compiler. Um, yeah, several people have come with ideas uh, that. Uh, but this is uh, what uh, really works right now. Um, yeah, I think I even have a minute for questions. <laughs> that was pretty quick, I think. <laughs> um, okay. <laughs> uh, yeah, by the way, um, this is part of a bigger project. It's in, in GitHub. It also has a small Perl 6 compiler. It's very incomplete, but it also, uh, well, it. Uh, loads in the browser, it compiles itself, and so on. Uh, this compiler, uh, it is uh, six years old. It also compiles to Python and uh, some other odd things like Ruby. Uh, yeah, it actually bootstraps in Python. You can compile Perl to something to itself uh, using Python. Uh, 